back to the calls we go. We're going to go to Mike in Cambridge. Mike in Cambridge, how are you tonight? I'm doing great. Hi, hey, Mike. How you doing, Dan? You're on, I'm, I'm great. You're on with Congressman Steve Lynch. Hey, Congressman. I, I really liked what you said about uh, that you were against Libya. I, I definitely was against that. Um, I wanted to ask you a question about a specific bill. There's the uh, repeal of marijuana pro- prohibition that Barney Frank and uh, Ron Paul and I know Michael Capuano now supports it. And uh, I definitely would like to hear your viewpoint on that, and especially, you know, considering jobs, the economy, hemp. Mike, Mike, is, Mike, Mike, this is Dan. Let me ask you, is that medical marijuana or yeah. marijuana right, generally? Completely, you know, basically what it does is it would leave, leave the states to decide. If they just want to legalize hemp, they could legalize hemp. If they just want to do medical, they could do medical. Every state would have their own rules, and it would just basically allow the federal government to get out of the business. Let the states decide. Yeah. Now, I was wondering... Yeah, I you know I I have um, I have mixed feelings on that to be honest with you. You know, if were you talking about legalizing marijuana for? I mean, there's got to be some some control on it, right? I'll say that again. I, I'm not sure what you're proposing here. I, I uh, you know, basically it's there were seven thousand bills it's, this session, and, yeah. and I, I I'm so not is, with is that your one. is your bill, Mike, basically legalize it, treat it like alcohol, can't be nope. sold? To- no, no. Actually, what the bill would do is allow the states to decide. Yeah. So, like right now, we have all these issues in California and Rhode Island with the medical. That's just one aspect. That's, then you have hemp farmers in the Midwest that want to grow. So the, fed, the feds would just step out of any involvement with with marijuana. Yeah, and let every state have a home rule on it. I let them decide. A fifty, like you know, experiment. Let's let's see if something's better than what we're doing. There's a lot of people might be experimenting there, Mike. If you get yeah, my drift, yeah. I don't know. We have a we have a structure right now where we do have uh, you know a a national sort of oversight of what gets what's get approved, what gets approved, what drugs get approved. The FDA and, and yeah, and it's it's very tough to start giving the states you know to segment one drug out and say okay. Uh, this is going to be done in 50 different ways. So I, I'm not so sure that, that that works. I haven't, I you know, you, you cut me off guard on this. I haven't, sure. I would really like to read the bill and understand it before I give you, you know, right now I'm giving you an, an, a completely uninformed uh, opinion. Yeah. I have to warn Mike, you about why don't that. Mike, why don't you send the congressman some materials on it and uh, and mention in your letter that uh, that you spoke with him here at Nightside, and I'm uh, sure I'll get back to you. Let me, let me just say this. I can be I can be persuaded. I am just not persuaded yet, okay? Right. Because I don't have enough information yet, okay? Thank you, gentlemen. Okay, thanks, thank, Mike. Have a great thank, night. Thank you, Mike. You too. Best of luck.